Welcome to the TakeMeFishing.org video series. We will be showing you the essentials and fundamentals of an activity that provides relaxation and enjoyment for outdoor enthusiasts, families, kids, and you. Here are two words that go beautifully together, surf and fishing. Just imagine yourself standing at a sandy shoreline or on a fishing pier. A spinning surf rod in hand, the wind in your face, and an ocean full of fish before you. Surf fishers say it's an exhilarating experience beyond compare. We want to help you plan a surf fishing trip that even a beginner can manage. One that will put you right where you need to be. Here are eight tips for going surf fishing. Number one, first of all, you'll need to check the fishing regulations in the state where you'll be fishing. Some states will require you to have a fishing license when fishing from a shoreline or pier. Number two, an essential piece of equipment for surf fishing is a good pair of polarized sunglasses. These will allow you to cut through the glare so that you can spot fish in the water. Number three, if you're wearing chest waders, you'll certainly need an elastic wading belt to prevent water from flowing inside. This is a safety measure in case you should fall. Number four, come prepared with a variety of natural baits like squid, shrimp, or mullet. These types of baits are effective for several species of fish. Number five, bring a bait bucket or cooler to keep those natural baits out of the sun. Number six, your surf fishing gear should be based upon the target species you're trying to catch. You'll want lighter gear and shorter rods for smaller species like bluefish, pompano, or flounder. But heavier gear and a longer rod for large species like striped bass, red drum, or shark. Number seven, as for surf fishing tackle, in addition to a variety of rigs, you'll want plenty of extra pyramid sinkers, egg sinkers, and a few teardrop sinkers inside your tackle box. These will help hold your baits in place when you're fishing in strong waters. Number eight, whether you're surf fishing in Florida, Texas, California, North Carolina, Massachusetts, or New Jersey, you'll learn that timing matters. The optimal time to surf fish is when the tide is either rising or falling. And if it's a hot day, you're better off fishing in the early morning hours or late in the afternoon. Before you know it, you'll be patrolling the deep holes and jetties of a prime fishing spot along some gorgeous beach, getting that exhilarating feeling and reeling in your supper with a smile. To learn more about where to fish and go surf fishing in your state, go to takemefishing.org.